That was Gotham Knights, and now we welcome, oh, look who it is, Neil Druckmann from Naughty Dog, uh, co-president of Naughty Dog. Uh, great to have you with us, Neil. It's been a, uh, an eventful day on the internet for Naughty Dog fans. We, and uh, I think we jinxed ourselves. We were joking about last night, like, watch the ass assets will leak, and yes. lo and behold, that's what happened. Well, the good news is there's some stuff that hasn't leaked that we have lots to share with people about uh, all things at Naughty Dog. But... First of all, it is a, you know, it's a big month actually for Last of Us fans because uh, Last of Us 1 and 2 both launched in June and it's nearing its two-year anniversary for Last of Us uh, Part 2, which is, is hard, to, hard to believe. Yeah, it's crazy. Uh, um, you know, nine years for Last of Us 1, two years for Last of Us Part 2, and we still hear from fans. They're still sending us letters and art and these characters in this journey and this world mean so much to them. Um, and it's, it's just been kind of amazing. Like Last of Us Part Two, early this year, passed a pretty big milestone. It sold over 10 million units. And that kind of support, that kind of success, um, we're so grateful to our fans. It has allowed us to grow as a studio, and now we can take on multiple projects, more than we've ever had at the same time. Multiple projects, okay, very interesting. So uh, what can Last of, Us, Last of Us fans expect in the future from you? Thank you for asking, Jeff. Yes. Uh, so one of the things we've mentioned a while back is what started out as a multiplayer mode has evolved due to the team's ambition. They really wanted to do something beyond what we've ever done before at Naughty Dog. And we felt the way to do it justice is to make it a standalone title. And over the, they've been working on it for the past two years. Ambition has grown. And we're not quite ready to fully unveil it, but we're ready to lift the curtain a little bit and just give you like an update of where we're at. Okay, well, uh, what can you tell us about this new standalone multiplayer game? Yeah, so uh, we have a concept art that we want to show. Yeah. Um, uh, but what, what I can tell you there Whoa. is that this game is big. Okay. Um, it's as big as any of our single player games that we've done, and in some ways bigger. It's got a story. Um, the way we're telling that story is very unique to this game. Um, it's got a brand new cast of characters. It takes place at another place, uh, another part of the United States. It's like a city might be somewhat familiar, some people. I'm sure our fans have already figured it out. Um, uh, and it's, it's, it's really cool. And it's being headed by Vinith Uggerwal, um, Anthony Newman, and uh, Joe Padnatti, all veterans of Uncharted and Last of Us. And you're going to see a lot more of this game come next year. Next year. So we wait till next year to hear more next about that year. one. Okay, well, very exciting that uh, this has evolved, and I mean, that concept art looks incredible. I can't wait to see Naughty Dog's storytelling fused with multiplayer live game. Uh, it's, it's something special. I, we can't wait to show it either. Okay, well, um, that's not all. We also have something that I've been reading about on the internet every day, it feels like, up in <laughs> Calgary. They're filming the Last of Us show for HBO, right? Yeah, so uh, for the past year, um, you know, we've teamed up with Craig Mazin of Chernobyl fame and HBO to adapt The Last of Us into a TV, uh, TV show. Um, they've been filming, and uh, it's pretty incredible. The stuff I'm getting back, when we're looking at back at Naughty Dog, we can't help but feel emotional because not only is it so good and the quality is so high, it's so authentic to what we've made in the game. Um, and... Uh, I just can't, I couldn't be proud of, like, again, Craig and that whole crew and everybody that's up there. Uh, and they're actually, their last day of filming is tomorrow. So the entire series, last day of filming is last tomorrow. Last day of filming is tomorrow. Craig is up there right now, wow. kind of wrapping it all up. Uh, so it's, it's pretty close. It's closer than you might think. And you actually got to direct one of the episodes? Yes, uh, I think that really speaks to the kind of collaboration and trust that exists between Naughty Dog and HBO. They invited me to direct one of the episodes. Um, I think we have an image from the episode I actually directed. Ooh, okay. Um, so we could first look. Let's take... <laughs> wow. So you can see uh, this is a certain museum that yes. players might know from the game. Um, and I really have to talk about Pedro Pascal and Bella Ramsey and not only directing them but seeing them do all the other episodes. They've thrown themselves at these roles um, for a whole year watching the nuance that they bring to these characters, their relationship on and off camera, I couldn't help but think about Troy Baker and Ashley Johnson. It felt so similar to the chemistry yeah. those two actors had when we made the game. Um, and it really feels like this is going to be something special. And I, I will say this will be the most authentic video yeah. game adaptation yet. Well, I mean, that first image that they put out, it just, I mean, it feels like the video game. Everything that I've seen, both public and other stuff, makes it feel sort of super legitimate, as you said, and that's awesome to see uh, Joel and Ellie from, from the front side now for the first time. Um, so we'll see more of that at next year that's coming as well, right, Sirius? Uh, you'll hear about it very soon. That's, that's okay. all I'll say right now. All right. Well, Last of Us HBO, very, very exciting. Uh, and I hear you actually have a couple actors from the show who are... Uh, 
going to join we us here? We happen to have a couple actors here that are part of the show. We should bring them up. Okay. Come on up. Oh, what's up, guys? Oh, hello. <laughs> Surprise. Tro Troy's back again. Hello, I know. Ashley. Good oh, to hi. see you. Good to see you. Uh, I'm a little confused, though. I, I thought maybe Pedro Bella, but Troy Ashley out here uh, from the game, right? So uh, when Craig and I started working on the show, almost one of our very first meetings, we said, Troy and Ashley have to be a part of it. Um, and we're such fans of like the talent and the help, like helping us create Joel and Ellie. Um, we felt like it was so important that they become part of the show. And it wasn't, it's, it has to be more than just like, kind of like a wink to the camera and like a cameo. Okay. These are real roles that we're keeping under wraps for now. Uh -huh. uh, but man, I was, I'm bummed that I couldn't be there with you guys when you filmed your stuff. That, there's been so much it's, stuff it's I so, feel like. so good. <laughs> on the internet, there's so much like talk about what's being filmed. And I think that's, you guys have kept a complete secret that you, so you were up there and you, you filmed your roles by now, obviously? Uh, well, keeping yeah. secrets yeah. with this franchise is kind of old hat. Like we've Except had- for yeah. 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 Except for today. Yeah. <laughs> Except for the date. Except for the date. It was, it was one of the hardest things for us to do is to let, not let people know that, because we're so proud of it and the work that we did, we worked hard, the, the crew, I have to say, um, when I walked out on set, um, to be met with literally every person that I met on that crew uh, is such a fan of this game, and they all knew what it was that they were working on and committed to working on this project because of their fan and their love for the for the game uh, was one of the greatest. It was like I was coming home to friends. Yeah, I, I the attention to detail, the crew was amazing. Bella and Pedro are man. I, they're so perfect, and it it we we've been trying to sort of describe that feeling of sort of seeing them in person. It's it's like, it's like the characters coming to life, but it it it's so much more than that. I feel like I can't fully explain it, but I am so excited to be a part of it, and just I can't wait to see it. I think it is going to be so good. It's, it's, so I love the story. I love no, just I, being I'm, a part of it. I'm so world. excited about the series and the fact that you guys are going to be in it and undisclosed roles. I'm so fascinated how it's going to sort of bob and weave and, and, you know, are these characters we know from the game that they're playing? New characters? Can you tell us anything? <laughs> yes. Mm. Okay. <laughs> I can tell you. So sneaky. All right. Well, we're so excited. Maybe to, it's already to, on Twitter by now. <laughs> <laughs> hey. All right. Well, 